Airfield Airfield. Far below, work was still going on to build the big new airport. Gosh, they're really getting on. Looks as if the runway's just about finished. Suddenly, he noticed something new. Hello? What's that? Lyle to Budgie, where are you now, Budgie? I'll be back in a few minutes, Lionel. I'm over the new airport. Good show, Budgie. But don't hang about, there's a thunderstorm on its way. What? A thunderstorm? Oh, crumbs. Right, Lionel. Lionel? Yes, Budgie? There's a funny-looking object down there. It looks like something from outer space. Ah, that'll be Concorde, the supersonic aircraft. Whoa! It flew some top people in to visit the airport. Oh! Ah. Rocketing rotors! I felt that! Budgie's a Lionel. I was jolly nearly hit by lightning then. Say again, Budgie. I said I was nearly hit by lightning. No go, Budgie. Radio interference. Probably the thunderstorm. Better get back soonest. Over. It's no use, Lionel. I can't tell what you're saying. I'm coming home. Over and out. These fronts have brought very turbulent atmospheric conditions and thunderstorms to many areas, and these will move across the country only very Mom. slowly. And Hello? Yes? We're going to, to see Mike Sprocket, Mum. What? Oh, just counties. a minute. <laughs> Sorry, say it again. We're going to see Mike. He said he was going to make us a kite. Mm, well, Mike will have maintenance work to do. We're only going to ask. Well, you'll have to wait until he's finished and don't get in the way. Um, are those scones, Mum? They certainly look like it. Oh, can I...? And the answer's no. Oh, Mum. But here's two I made earlier. Ooh, thanks. Now hop it and leave me in peace. OK. And don't get in the way. Right. And watch the time. OK. About his long journey. Then an hour later, there's the first instalment of Aliens Have Landed. Oh, the kite. I'd forgotten about that. Oh? Yeah, sorry, man. I haven't had time. Budgie's radio's been on the blink. What's wrong with it? Oh, a couple of transistors have gone down. What does that mean? Uh. <laughs> It means it doesn't work. How's it going, Mike? Just finished. Should be OK now. I I'll give it a go. Job, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Must be the frequency control. We'll leave you to it. Come on, kids. How about helping me load some packages onto Dell? Oh, yes. Right. This will give you an appetite for tea. We have to load all these onto here. Crumbs. Right. Ah, Pippa. Hello, Lionel. Are you off on a job? Yes, a bit of a nuisance. Wanted to test Budgie's radio in flight to base. Now you'll have to do it, all right? Yes, of course, Lionel. He's just taken off. He'll radio back. Right. Good show. Well, I'll be off then. Cheerio. Bye, Lionel. We still haven't got a kite. I told you he'd be busy. Yeah, there was something wrong with Budgie's radio. It took him ages to get it right. So now what are you going to do? Dunno, really. And now it's time for our new six-part drama serial, Aliens Have Landed, part one. The What's coming. the programme, Mum? Aliens Have Landed, one of those science fiction things. Looking science back, fiction? Oh, great, terror. I love it's science hard fiction. To see how we're going to be we'll sit down and listen and you might get another Aliens scone. Budgie to Lionel, Budgie to Lionel. It's not Lionel, Budgie, it's Pippa. Oh, hi, Pippa. Lionel will be back till evening. I'm doing the radio test. Over. Well, this is it. Testing, testing. One, two, three, four. Receiving you loud and clear. Oh, not again. I don't believe... You're it. interrupting this programme with a WNR newsflash. What? Hello? Hello, Budgie? Come in, Budgie. Oh. At 6.30 this morning, alien life forms landed their spacecraft on planet Earth. Rocketing rotors! Aliens! The flying saucer touched down on farm fields in the county of Oakhamshire. Oakhamshire? That's us! 
Police car said to investigate the huge black glistening flying saucer was destroyed by the aliens' laser weapons. I knew they'd have laser guns. Shh. Before the extraterrestrials set off across the countryside, destroying roads and bridges as they went. Oh, rocketing rotors. We're being invaded. Budget of pepper. Budget of pepper. Over. Oh, it's no use. I'd better get back. They might be invading the airfield. Here? It was on the radio. A special emergency announcement. Oh, gosh. A Lionel won't be home for hours. We've got to do something. Where's Chuck? I'll call him up. Pippa to Chuck. Pippa to Chuck. We're being invaded by aliens. Come in, please. Aliens? you got to be kidding. Budgie heard a special bulletin. Hmm. Hey, listen. I saw something a little weird a couple miles back. I'm three miles east of the airfield. Get over here! Hi, fellas. Listen, you said the aliens came in a shiny black flying saucer, right? Right. See down there? Black, shiny, and kind of saucer-shaped. Wow, yes, we're the aliens. Search me. Say, Pippa. Yes? How about you take a look around? You move faster than us, harder to hit. Me? Oh, gosh. Oh, all right, I'll do it. Just a quick pass, Pippa. Be careful. I can't see any sign of... Wow! There they are! Chuck! Gotcha, kiddo! I think she's got something. There's a whole line of them. They've been digging up the road. There's a huge trench right along it. A trench? Hey, I think I've got an idea. Just keep an eye on them, Pippa. We'll be with you as soon as we can. Sandbags? Yeah, we got sandbags. How many do you want? One for me and one for Chuck. Right, you hang on here. I'll go and get them. Aliens. Cool. This had better work, you know. Good luck! Give them what for? Yes! Well, the Paris is over. we better get after them. They're going to need all the help they can get. Right, let's go! Look! Chuck! There they are! Budgie to Pepper, over! Receiving you loud and clear, Budgie! We're nearly there, Pepper! See if you can get them looking your way. And look out for ray guns. Right, Budgie. I'm going in. Hi. What the... Huh? Now what? Hey! Hey! I got one. And another. Hooray! Let me get at them. That's what they are! Aliens! And another! Me too! Yeah! Yeehaw! That's all of them! You've got them all! Wow, Chuck! We've done it! Before they come round, shovel them in! Gotcha, Bacco! Silly things in your time, but this time you've gone too far. Smashed umpteen giant traffic cones, undone a week's work, terrified the night watchman, infuriated the local residents... But gee, Captain! It is Lionel, and but nothing! But it was the radio, Lionel, honestly! Absolute rot. Nothing wrong with the radios. I had mine serviced only yesterday, and it works perfectly well. Listen to this. Testing, testing. You see? Absolutely perfect. <laughs> hey? What? 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 What's going on? <laughs> and don't you dare laugh. Don't you dare. Oh! 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 Oh!
Don't shut up.